this lecture i am going to tell you about a real time application that i have developed on code.org using the basic features of app lab so in this uh, app what happens this is a first screen you know the user is going to come across when he will first access this app on his device now what he has to do he need to enter over here his name for now i am entering my own name over here and here i he has to enter his mobile number so for now i am entering my own mobile number and once the user is done with entering his name and mobile number over here he can hit this uh, thumbs up over here thanks for entering the required information gore please use the mentioned otp for connecting this remote with your tv set okay now uh, he is going to come across this beautiful screen where he'll get to see his name and phone number uh, reflecting right on the top and there is an otp which he will get to see below this phone number fine now with this otp he can connect his tv set now how that is going to happen this is what we are going to see now let's come on the second device this this is a second browser and you need to assume it as if it is a second device now the user need to hit this uh, beautiful image over here hi user kindly enter the otp for connecting this tv set with your remote okay once he is done with hitting that image automatically he is going to come across this beautiful uh, screen where he'll get to see a tv uh, set and a dish tv also now what he has to do in order to connect this remote which he is accessing on another device he need to enter this otp over here uh, in this input box so the otp is this dt 554 then it is gorov okay now let's enter a channel from this remote so i'm going to select this bc from this drop down first and let's see what happened in 1500 bc so we need to select we need to type 1500 using this keyboard kind of thing present on this remote over here 1 5 0 okay now let's hit this okay button and see what is going to happen channel no bc 1500 will be soon set on your television you are watching channel bc 1500 so this is channel bc 1500 coming of the aryans the indo-aryan migration theory note 1 proposed among others by anthropologist david w anthony in the horse the wheel and language and by archaeologist selena efimovna kuzmina and j p mallory shows that the introduction of the indo-aryan languages in the indian subcontinent was the result of a migration of people whose culture originated in the syntashta culture moving through the bactria margiana culture and into the northern indian subcontinent modern day india nepal bhutan bangladesh pakistan and sri lanka these migrations started approximately 1800 bce after the invention of the war chariot and also brought indo-aryan languages into the levant and possibly in eurasia okay so this is what the user will get to see on the second device now let's come on this third browser and you have to assume that as if uh, it is a third device on which we are right now and let's set this beautiful uh, graph kind of image over here so now i am not going to enter any otp over here let's uh, change the channel to 563 bc and see whether we'll be able to see the channel on both these devices or not so i'm changing it to 563 bc now 5 6 3 channel no bc 563 will be soon set on your television you are watching channel bc 563 The Buddha, also known as Siddhartha Gautama or Siddhartha Gautama, Note 3 or Buddha Shakyamuni, 
was a philosopher, mendicant, meditator, spiritual teacher, and religious leader who lived in ancient India, c. 5th to 4th century BCE. Note 4, he is revered as the founder of the world religion of Buddhism, and worshipped by most Buddhist schools as the enlightened one who has transcended karma and escaped the cycle of birth and rebirth. He taught for around 45 years and built a large following, both monastic and lay. His teaching is based on his insight into dukkha, typically translated as suffering, and the end of dukkha, the state called nibbana or nirvana. Okay, so as you can see, we are able to see this uh, channel BC 563 on this first uh, TV set, but it is not coming on this second TV set. Why? Because we haven't set the OTP over here. Okay, we haven't connected this TV set with this remote, that is the reason we are not able to see this channel on this TV set. And you know with this uh, concept, people who uh, doesn't like geography or SST, they definitely are going to love it now, they'll start loving it now. Fine, now let's see what is going to happen if I will enter this OTP over here also. Let's check it out. So I am entering, um, let's select this AD period. And now I am going to select 405. 4, 0, 5. Let's hit this OK button. Channel no AD 405 will be soon you are set watching on your channel, you are watching AD, channel 405. AD 405. So as you can see in real time, I'm able to change the channel. F A G N, a Chinese pilgrim, a Chinese pilgrim visited, visited India during the reign of during the reign of Chandragupta II. His primary aim His primary was to visit, aim the, Buddhist was to visit the Buddhist religious places, places and to take with him the copies, with him the copies, copies of the Buddhist, Buddhist texts. religious texts. He therefore he traveled therefore, through the Gupta Empire, through the Gupta Empire and also wrote down and also his wrote impressions, down about, his impressions India. about India. As his main interest, his main was, interest religion, was religion, we know nothing about, know the, nothing about the political condition of, condition of, India, from of his India from his account. However, his However, account helps his us account to know something about the social and religious, and religious condition, of that, condition of that period. Okay, so uh, why you guys were here, were able to hear two different speeches just because uh, one was coming from this device and the second was coming from this device. Now let's see whether we'll be able to connect these two TVs with two different remotes or not. So I am going to access uh, this on another device. Thanks for entering the required information, Abana. Please use the mentioned OTP for connecting this remote with your TV set. Okay, currently I'm accessing this app on four different devices. So on the two devices, I am accessing the remote panels and on the rest of the two devices, I am accessing the two different TV sets. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to uh, connect this TV set, this TV set with this remote and the second remote with the second TV set. How we can do that? We can do that by you know entering this OTP over here. So that is already there. The now enter this OTP which is getting reflected over here on this panel of the second TV set. So DT870 and then it is a B now. Okay, let's uh, select medieval from here and now I'm going to enter 1469. Let's see what happened in the medieval period uh, on this 1469. One, four, six, nine. Okay, let's now hit this OK button. Channel No Medieval 1469 will be soon set on your television. You are watching Channel Medieval 1469. Nanak is said to have traveled far and wide across Asia teaching people the message of Ikankar, one god who dwells in every one of his creations and constitutes the eternal truth, too. With this concept, he would set up a unique spiritual, social, and political platform based on equality, fraternal love, goodness, and virtue. So as you can see, this remote is now controlling this TV. And if you want to control this TV, the second one, you can make use of this remote. Let's enter a date uh, from this modern period. Let's enter 1947. Let's see what happened One, on 1947. 9, 4, 7. Okay, let's hit this OK button. Channel No Modern 1947 you are watching will be channel soon modern set on your television. 
The partition of India of 1947 was the division of British India c, into two independent dominion states, India and Pakistan. 6. The Dominion of India is today the Republic of India. The Dominion of Pakistan is today the Islamic Republic of Pakistan and the People's Republic of Bangladesh. The partition involved the division of two provinces, Bengal and Punjab, based on district-wise non-Muslim or Muslim majorities. The partition also saw the division of the British Indian Army, the Royal Indian Navy, the Indian Civil Service, the Railways, and the Central Treasury. The partition was outlined in the Indian Independence Act 1947 and resulted in the dissolution of the British Raj, or Crown Rule in India. The two self-governing countries of in. Let's now check out the code that I have made use of uh, for developing this beautiful app. So you know when the user will uh, access this app on his device, this is the first screen he's going to come across. Now, uh, there is a label box which I have placed over here. When the user will hit the label box, automatically he is going to get redirected on this beautiful screen one. Uh, you know, whatever name and whatever phone number he will enter here. Automatically, he will get to see both the things reflecting right on the top of this screen. Besides that, a random OTP is also going to get generated. Now, uh, there is a TV remote which is there present on this screen. Fine. Now the idea of this uh, button is okay and for these buttons which you are seeing over here numbered 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 I have placed some label boxes over these buttons. Okay. Now when the user will this uh, button 1 this is the code which is going to get executed. If he will hit this button 2 this will uh, going to get executed and same is the thing going to happen when the user will hit this uh, button 3 then this is for button 4 this is for button 5 this is for button 6 then 7 then 8 then 9 and finally for 0 okay once the user is done with entering the number hit this ok button and when he will hit this ok button this is the code which will get executed automatically so a table named channel is going to get created on the data browser in which the name and the OTP are going to get saved. Now automatically as soon as the channel will get created on the data browser on this screen too the uh, you know everything will be visible to the user in real time. So this is the code which I have made use of for fetching the details from this uh, table named channel and once the details are fully fetched so they are going to get reflected on this TV screen and besides that whatever record had got created whatever record has got created in this channel named table that will also get deleted simultaneously fine and there is a table with name data which I would like to show you in which the, you know all the information related to whatever uh, is going to get reflected over here on this screen too is present so the uh, ear is also there then the uh, information related to that ear is also there and the picture is also there fine so there is a condi there are some conditions which this data has to satisfy on the basis of which the information is going to get reflected over here on this tv set fine and the information will only get reflected on this tv set if the otp over here matches with the one which is there in this table named channel present against this uh, name of the channel fine then only the required information is going to get reflected on this tv set okay so this is it from my side i uh, hope you guys enjoyed this lecture a lot do like and subscribe to my channel and also uh, do avail coding classes facility in case you want to know more Thank you very much. God bless you and have a great day. Bye-bye.